me poppin', I'm a blossom I don't need a bop, mine to my robbery I'm official, on a dotty You can hit a room, room in my robbery I'm not sorry, no, I'm not sorry It's official, I'm a problem I don't need a dis- Hey Royals, welcome back to my channel. As you all see my title, today's video is going to be a productive entrepreneur vlog and some more stuff, like just a little bit of everything. Today's vlog, I plan to, well first of all, I told you guys yesterday that I was about to be shopping for some additional inventory, so we're definitely going to do that. It's probably not too exciting for you guys to watch me shop for inventory specifically, but I did tell you all that I found a way to find an amazing vendor, reducing a huge amount of time. Let me just take you all down memory lane. When I first started my business, every single thing that was on my site, I got from Alibaba.com because they literally have every single thing. Like my rings here, this oversized jean jacket that literally everyone loved and wanted me to bring back these quality name necklaces as well as this was like a favorite my mama africa pendant necklaces and plenty of other things if you're looking to start a business it's like a huge and an amazing platform for small business owners because i mean they have anything and everything you could ever think of if you want to sell bubble mailers poly mailers if you want to sell socks panties pajamas clothes if you need containers for your shea butter even if you're a super picky person when it comes to your business or when it comes to shopping in general they make it really easy for you to pick what you do and do not want but what i didn't know and i just learned recently as i was like looking to expand my business and thinking about other things that i wanted to bring onto my site i was like how can i find this stuff without taking so much time every single time i would watch a video of someone starting their business and they talked about alibaba.com they will always say if you're looking for jewelry or if you're looking for necklaces just go on to alibaba.com and type in necklaces and just look until you find something you like no more so I'm gonna show you guys exactly what's tea, what I figured out in order to find exactly what you want. It doesn't take as much time, if that makes sense. So let's let's go. Here we are, we're on the site. As you can see up here, it says, what are you looking for? And this is typically where we just type necklaces, rings, whatever it is that we may be looking for. So let's say today we're looking for socks. So we're gonna search socks. And typically, so as you can see here, 130,491 results for socks. Naturally, it makes you search for just products, but what will make it a lot easier, you wanna go ahead and switch from products to suppliers. So you switch from suppliers, and then over here, you have all these different options in which you can filter out your searches. So we have trade assurance, you have verified supplier, and if you may even wanna to talk to someone who has an hour or less response time, you can click that. You can click if you want ready to ship, pay samples, fast dispatch. So when doing my research, I took notes. Now there are different supplier types. The supplier types are gold, assessed, and trade assurance. Even this jogging suit, for instance, I got this super amazing quality soft and I actually put it out on my birthday collection. You all have seen all the fire pictures, my thumbnail picture for my YouTube channel. I'm in this and yes, I put on my bonnet y'all because I'm ready to go to bed but i'm still just <laughs> wanting to tell you all so if you're interested in me actually going more into depth then let me know and i can definitely show you all but basically what i'm saying is when you search for a supplier and you're very specific about what type of supplier you want what level of supplier you want how many years in business they are if you're doing jewelry for instance what type of finish they use and stuff like that these are just a few more filters that would take you from let's say 130,000 different things to search through versus 5,000. hope that helps somebody anyway let's get into the rest of this video all right so right now in order for me to prepare for my training there's 10 videos with corresponding quizzes that i have to go ahead and complete so i've completed seven so far i'm about to finish the last three and then after that i actually have to go ahead and like uh thread my machine and stuff so and like switch out some parts or add on some parts so i'm going to film all that for you all so you can see how that goes and then tomorrow while i'm training i might even film like my first design or practice so you guys can see how that goes and i'm excited to see myself i'm just about to get into these quizzes so let's get in
I took a break from putting that together, y'all, because it was time to break fast. Got some Papa John's pizza. No so cheese pizza, dip it in the garlic. Mm. Y'all ain't never had a good plate of food until you fast all day. No, honestly, you ain't had a good sip of water until you fast all day. But it's hit different. It just really makes you appreciate everything that you have. So my dad offered to come over and help out with the machine, but then I told him like, you know, it's cool, it's late. I know you've had a long day. Like literally our family, it's just so much going on. My sister just had knee surgery. My mom just left out of town today. My brother left out of town on Monday. It's just like literally ugh, so much. I told him that it was okay. I told him like, you know, for training tomorrow, what we did should be like good enough. Like, of course, I'm going to finish um, working on the machine and stuff, but, like, as far as the machine being, like, level, I feel like it should be okay. I'm about to finish eating my dinner. I'm going to move on to that again. I just have a long night, y'all. Like, I really have a long night. Like, what time is it? It's 9 o'clock right now. Hopefully, 1 o'clock I'll be done. That's what I'm going to say. 1 o'clock. I got to get up at 4, so there's that. I'll see you guys. Okay, so remember when I told you all that I would probably stay up to 1 a.m.? I was right. I was up until 1 a.m. Attempting to throw in my machine and all that good stuff. And yes, yeah, so this morning I woke up at 4. And I was trying to work on the machine a bit more. I'm going to show you guys where I'm at. I had training and I took a lot of notes. I, have, I actually have to rewrite my notes because my notes were so sloppy. But that's page 1. Then page 2, 3, 4, 5 and then just these little notes right here so i'm gonna rewrote rewrite them like i said but this is the most mo well to me this was the most important part he told me to call it my bible that's how important it was <laughs> so i went ahead and wrote down all these notes and then the other notes are pretty much just like about the basics of the machines needle stabilizer bobbin etc so yes i'm really excited to get into it. i'm gonna show you guys what it looks like so this is my sh machine right now. I have the flat piece here for the shirts. I have it hooked and everything. But the one thing that I was unable to do is actually do the design because I had it threaded improperly. But now that I know all the steps and everything like that, I'm gonna come back when I get off of work today, re-thread the machine properly. And we're gonna get into it. Day one of training. This is what it looks like. And y'all, I'm gonna show you actually tomorrow, maybe, well not tomorrow's video, but probably Monday's video. I'm gonna show you guys what it's like for me to re-thread the machine and then also do my first attempt at embroidering something because I'm so excited so I can do shirts, hats, jackets, whatever. And honestly, any and everything. But these are all the colors that I have set up. And we're just going to get into it. We're going to have fun with it. So, yeah. Let me check the time. It's currently 1.03. I have to move out of here about 1.50. But I'm going to get off of work early today. I'm about to go ahead right now and set off some numbers so I can send out orders I'm just gonna do later so where's my tripod I just feel like my life is completely discombobulated right now so I don't know but I thought that my inventory closet was organized until I start like opening drawers like I just have the most random stuff in my drawers like <laughs> what is this I just I just don't understand. Oh, yeah. And you know how I kept saying I was going to take my nails off? I finally actually cut them down. So that's good. But that's not why we're here. I'm so excited because I have some new scents as well, you guys. And this is going to be... This has already been a busy week. But it's going to be um, this weekend. Or maybe actually I'll just try to maybe just have a wild friday i sent off packages this morning aside from the ones that i got last night so again thank you to everyone who's been shopping let me check um 
I'm about to go ahead and check out my orders right now. As you can see here, I have 10 orders that I need to do. The ones that have not been fulfilled thus far. My nails look disgusting. So I'm going to do that this evening. Film that um, for content for next week. So thank you guys so much for... If you haven't already, make sure you come over to my site and shop. Use code FREESHIP in order to get free shipping. Only requirement is that your order amount comes up to $15 or more. I'm sorry that this vlog wasn't like super duper duper active, but I've just had the craziest and most busy week, but hopefully you got some good information from here. And this is gonna be the end of the vlog. If you're new to my channel, make sure you go ahead and hit the subscribe button, give this video a huge thumbs up, comment down below any questions, comment, concerns, videos, suggestions, and all that good stuff. And I will see you guys in the next video. I'm not gonna tell you guys what the next video is because I always tell them tea like, no ma'am. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.